Assalamualaikum and good day to all of you. So today, I will present chapter 7 for course propeller system in module 17. Okay, so let's start. So what you can see here, chapter 7 is all about propeller storage and preservation. How you want to store the propeller and how you want to preserve the propeller after a long time of you do not use it okay so this example of the figure shown here it's a lot of wooden propellers very old you can see okay spider web here accumulate here right okay topics so what topics will be covered here today General propeller preservations on wing. What does it mean by on wing? Meaning the propeller is attached to the engine at the aircraft. Okay, we have here another subtopic: propeller preservation of wing. It's a long term storage of me of wing means. Propeller no longer attached to the engine at the aircraft, meaning you have removed your propeller. So we have wood propellers, how you want to store the wood propellers and propeller depreservations. So what do you know what is depreservations? You already know about preservation. Preservation is a long term storage. Okay. What do you mean by long-term storage? We have more than two years. We have more than five years and so on. Is it you can use it or not? Let's see. So what is propeller depreservation means? Depreservation is you want to use the propeller after a long time you store it okay, in the storage. Okay, suddenly there is no, what we call it, uh, extra and then the current propeller you have sent at a house repair and it cannot come back at the aircraft on time. So you need to run the aircraft immediately. You need to go abroad immediately, maybe in emergency. So you have to use whatever you have inside the store. You know you have propellers. They are already long time stored in the storage. So about general, the first one, propeller preservation and depreservation described in CMM. CMM means Component Maintenance Manual and SB, Service Bulletin. So SB is from manufacturer. Propeller remains installed in a stored aircraft. You need to refer AMM. AMM is Aircraft Maintenance Manual. Propellers installed on an engine which may be out of use for a period up to 3 months should be kept clean and should be inspected regularly for corrosions. If the engine is likely to be out of use for more than three months, the propeller mechanism should be flushed with inhibiting oil and all external parts of the propeller should be treated with lanolin or an approved rust preventative. So this is another topic, propeller preservations on wing. You can see here, Okay, let me draw. The propeller is still attached, right? At the engines. Okay. How it preservation on wing. Okay, example is SAAB S2000 aircraft. So, what happened to this aircraft? Okay. Short term parking from 0 to 45 days. There's no conservation. After 45 days, okay, about one and a half months, run the engines and at least 50 minutes and park 
okay, parking the aircraft for next 45 days and so on. If aircraft park from 46 until 180 days, 180 days is about how many months? I guess 6 months, right? 6 times 30 days is 180 days. After uh, From 46, from 1.5 months until 6 months, make sure the power plant, which is the engine, has fresh oil and new oil filters before do this preservation procedure. This remove acid and oxide that can cause damage to the engine and propeller. Install restraining bridles to prevent windmilling. Okay, so what is restraining bridles? It's one kind of restraining bridles. Okay, you don't want this thing. Okay, you don't want this uh, propeller blade. We call it rotating. Rotate. Okay, to prevent windmilling. Meaning, there's air. In case air flow, right? Air flow here. So what will happen to the what happened to the propeller? It try to turn to turn to turn or to rotate, right? Okay, you understand this? Next, install blade protective covers. So where you can see blade covers, for example, here. So this is the cover to cover up the blades. Okay, you can see another one here, down here. Okay, blade covers. Okay. So this is another example of bridles. Let me erase this. So you need, you can get confused. No, not blue. Okay, this is the one example of burdles, restraining burdles to prevent from the blade to rotate. After 180 days, after 6 months, if the aircraft remains serviceable, depreserve the aircraft run for the engines at least 50 minutes and preserve again. Preserve means you store it okay, for long term. Right? So next. Preservations of wing. Okay, meaning you have removed your the whole set of your propeller. Okay, maybe you have the governors inside. Okay, the accumulators. So long term storage here is divided into two. Number one is controllable pitch propeller. Number two, governors and accumulators. Long term storage for controllable pitch propeller. Storage time is determined from date of manufacturer overhaul or removal from aircraft okay storage must be in a clean and dry environment preferably in the original shipping carton and above ground level to minimize exposure to dirt and moisture so we have two types which is exit two years another one is exit five years for long-term storage i mentioned earlier So for exit two years, okay, all propellers models inspect externally for damage and corrosion. Inspection may be accomplished only by certified mechanic. Okay, number two, non oil field propeller models remove propeller cylinder, inspect for internal corrosions and signs of deteriorations and repair as necessary. Also, must be accomplished only by an approved propeller repair station or international equivalent in accordance with the appropriate propeller service manual. Last one, you have to make logbook entry. However, for five years, okay, it's a bit complicated. You need to disassemble as necessary to replace all rubber seals and lubricants. Total disassembly. This must be accomplished only by approved propeller repair station or international equivalent academic with appropriate propeller service manual. Also, you have to make logbook entry, inspect parts for damage and corrosion, repair or replace parts as necessary. So you can see the difference of exit two years and exits of five years.
for long term storage. So another one is long term storage of governance and accumulators. If storage period exceeds two years before enter service or return to service, so you need to perform the following inspections. Inspect externally for damage and corrosion. Test run the governor on a governor test bench to verify correct operations and check for leakage. This must be accomplished only by an approved governor repair station or international equivalence. Okay. IAW, the Governor Service Manual. Pressure check accumulator to verify correct operation and check for leakage. Also, this must be accomplished only by an approved Governor Repair Station or International Equivalence in accordance with Governor Service Manual as well. Next, exit 5 years for long term storage of governors and accumulators. You need to do this following inspection and part replacement. Completely release all air or nitrogen pressure before any disassembly of accumulator. Removal of retaining rings with air pressure inside the cylinder with, will result in explosive blowout of parts with danger of serious injury. Disassemble as necessary to replace all rubber seal and gasket. Total disassembly is not required unless evidence of corrosion. Inspect part for damage and corrosion, repair or replace if necessary. This is for 5 years. Long term storage. We want to use it, okay? The governance, for example, is exit 5 years. We have stored in the storage, so you need to do all this uh, following inspection and part replacement. So, wooden propellers. So how you want to store the wooden propellers should be stored in horizontal position. So how it looks like from horizontal position, like this, like lay down the propeller blade. You can step out, yes, no problem. Okay. So wood propeller when left with its blades in vertical position. Moisture can collect in lower blade. Okay, that's why when you put put the propeller like this in vertical, so okay, in the lower blade, okay, it can be moist here. Okay, moist will be accumulate here in the lower blade. So it will cause out of balance conditions already covered in chapter six. So a craft with three blades constant speed propeller if less left outside the position the propeller with one blade pointing down. Okay, so this is special for three blades. Another blade you need to point down. Okay. Why we need to prevent water from collecting around a blade seal and entering the hub. So never store a propeller or blade standing on the tips. Okay. So you cannot just simply put on the floor. No, it's wrong. Okay. Next, propeller depreservations. Okay, what is depreservation means? You need to use it after long term storage. And want you want to use it, depreserve. You want up when the propeller is in preservation, and you want to take out. Okay, which is remains. D preservations. If the storage period is less than two years, carry out a general visual inspection on its conditions, investigate and correct any questionable conditions, check current SB and manufacturer technical info. Okay, documents may have been issued since manufacture overhaul, which require compliance. If storage uh, exceed two years, comply with above requirement and in addition. Okay, this is for less than 2 years. However, exit 2 years, these are the things you need to follow. Okay. Inspect or for internal external damage or corrosion, pain and plating has not to be removed. Total disassembly is not necessary unless corrosion or damage was found. Replace part as necessary. Replace all seals and gasket. Replace the lubricant according to the applicable overhaul manual. Okay, test the I system if applicable. 
including boots. Ensure that boots are still well worn with no sign of blistering or peeling. Repaint and replace components as required. After accomplish required procedure, the propeller may be released for full TBO. You know what TBO means? Time between overhaul. Above procedure must be accomplished by an approved propeller repair station. Okay. So, so in the airline station, no. Okay, it's a only approved propeller repair station. So last one. This is a review. Uh, can we pay it? Okay, wooden propeller maintenance and storage. Let's see. Sorry, I cannot pay it here. Okay, I will share the link afterward. Okay, that's all. So, any questions you can ask. Alright, thank you.